it's annoying what is happening right now in Nigeria about nurses. Here are the things you need to know about the happenings, the recent happenings, the negligence, the negligence and the breach of duties that has been happening in the Nigerian healthcare system. And the, the most of these things are being pushed to the nurses, okay? So I'm not defending anyone, but this is what you should know. Number one, not everybody wearing um, uniform is a nurse. In a hospital or in a health, healthcare system, if you come to a hospital, most people... The the, the the people could be uh, a port it could be a healthcare assistant it can also be a nurse it can be anyone now porters in the hospital porters the people that um, wheel patients or lift patients okay they wear uniforms okay and healthcare assistants also wear uniforms so these not all of those people that you're seeing on the video are nurses most of these people most of these people you're referring to as nurses are quacks they are auxiliaries okay most hospitals can't afford registered nurse now who is a registered nurse who is a, certif a certified nurse? A certified nurse or a registered nurse is any nurse that has a license that has been certified by a body and has undergone the training and passed the examinations by a body or an organization and then has been given the right to practice as a nurse with a valid license and a certification. Now, every country has theirs. In Nigeria, ours is the Nursing and Midwifery Council of Nigeria. And this body is not joking, okay? Have you ever wondered why all of the happenings has been happening, no nurse or um, a nurse has been punished or the nurse that was um, seen has not been punished? This is because they have found out that these people are not nurses. Every nurse that is practicing has their license with them. Before your license expires and before you get them, you go and meet them. They will do evaluation, do some, um, you will do some exams and um, updated practices and before your license can be given to you again. Now, every nurse, every nurse you know in Nigeria is registered with them, okay? So, if you go against the rules and regulation, you will be sanctioned or you will be given a strike. And most of the times, when this body go and check, these people are not registered nurses. These people are not registered with them. They are quacks, okay? That is why most of these people go free. And at the end of the day, probably the hospital will be shut down or anything can be done. But that person that did the wrong is not a nurse. Most of these hospitals can't even afford a certified nurse. I was looking for a job and one told me I can't pay you. I need an auxiliary. He said he can't pay me. Um, the owner of the hospital. When I'm, I'm talking about when I just graduated from school and I didn't really have much um, experience. Okay, but this um, person, the owner of the hospital, this is in nowhere. Told me in our hospital we only um employ one registered nurse maximum two registered nurses and we had two and the other one has left but we don't have the resources to pay you okay uh, except you will work as an auxiliary and then end the same salary as an auxiliary okay and an auxiliary are, or auxiliary nurses or our quacks they are people that didn't really go to nursing school they went to a hospital too and they are trained by the doctors okay in a hospital they don't have the license to practice as a nurse they didn't go to the school they didn't go to the clinical um postings and everything they don't have license and they are not certified by this body i'm talking to you about because trust me i know what i went through to get my licenses okay every nurse know, knows what she went through nobody will misbehave we have our code of conduct okay so that's why you will not see or you've not seen um where a body brings out this nurse and say okay this is what has happened this is what has happened because that person is not a nurse and this video is also a video to i wish this video would just go viral it's a video to um talk to the board to our board of nurses um uh, the nursing council and to the government to shut down hospitals that are still employing auxiliary nurses that are still employing quacks they are doing more there are doing so many um harm to the healthcare system okay because if you don't employ a registered nurse and you employ an auxiliary he does she does not know the codes uh, um conduct of the nursing council she does not even know she might know how to give injection but she does not know what this injection does why should i not give a patient an injection when he or she has not eaten which when you eat what are you supposed to eat that will counteract the infection she does not know the mechanism of the of the drugs she's about to give she doesn't know anything okay he or she they can be he or she so please stop bashing nurses before you make an accusation get your facts right okay and let such hospitals be 
um looked upon let's not trust me to anywhere you notice that these are quacks let it be looked upon please and make sure you share this video and like i made a video about your rights as a person your rights as a patient your rights when you go to a hospital what's your rights is if it's being infringed on then you can talk okay thank you and god bless